my fellow stars, it's Ventrix here with another Minecraft video, and yes, it has been a really long time since I've done Minecraft on my channel. Today we're actually starting a, a mod pack that I found. It is on 1.12, which is interesting. I actually found a really nice one. I was looking through my um, the Twitch app to see what mods they have, and I found this because I looked for exploration because I wanted an exploration pack. And then I found this pack called Roguelike Adventures Dungeons. And it looked awesome. It looked like it was going to be like a whole dungeon type of adventure mod pack. Which is what I like to do. That's actually one of my favorite mod packs. This has a bunch of different dimensions too. Which we could jump into which are really nice. But first things first. Because it's the first episode of course. We gotta do the normal Minecraft things. Um, we do get like a starting house which is really nice. So... Let's go ahead and find where we can start this, because I think this does give you, like, starter tools, so I don't have to create them myself. Um, let's go ahead and go over here. Got some water here. So, yeah, I just found this, and I was like, you know what, I want to do, like, a mod series. That water's really loud, not gonna lie. Basic house, uh, ranch-style house, hobbit-style house. We don't really live in a hobbit style area, but I think what will match this area is the ranch style house, so I'm gonna build that. I want this to be our home. So yeah, as you guys can see, it's like just a quick house. This is gonna be our temporary house for now. Um, just temporary for now until like, you know, I get something that I want. Uh, you can't plant these. Um, I can plant the normie seeds. I don't know what the normie seeds do, but... Yeah, those are literally called normie seeds. I picked them up right as I loaded in. Which makes me a little bit confused, because I don't know what that is. But, yeah. Um, we can go ahead and look through some stuff about this mod. There's, like, a lot of mods I've seen that are... Some are familiar, but I don't know all of them. This house does come up with, like, some starter stuff in one of these chests. I know that. Yep, see? Full leather armor with stone tools, which is actually really nice and helpful for us. Um, we got food, which is really good. So yeah, definitely some stuff to help us out on our first set here. We grab these seeds so we can grow a bit more. So, so if I'm around bread, I can make some more. But yeah, I was looking through this mod because I decided to play on my own to give it a little test, see what it's like. Um, there's some features I do like in this mod pack. There's also um, quests, so there's some quests we can actually fulfill in this. You guys look here so here's our quest book we're here with exploration one soon we'll get into toilet forest either tropic craft look at all these look at all these awesome things we could get into so i'm thinking about throughout the series is that it's gonna be separated first we'll get through all the vanilla minecraft stuff in the overworld and then we'll start going to the forest completing all that stuff and of course go in the order of what this is so so we got our first achievement here, actually, if we look here, visit Dimension Overworld, so we pretty much started in the overworld, so what I'm going to go with since the last time when I was in this, I, I, I don't remember what I went with, I don't know if I went with Warrior, I think I went with Survival, I'm going to go with Warrior, and we're just going to grab this stuff out of this, because this gives you stuff, as you guys can see, I think I did choose Warrior last time, I think it was in my other book, so what it gives you is an Iron Sword, a shield and some food um so just like that we can go ahead and smelt that and i can go ahead and put this on we even got like ourselves a free mine right here as you guys can see so this gives you like a starter mine it gives you some starter ores there's actually a lot of types of ores in this so that's pretty hyped about this let's go ahead and look around through our chest see if i need to grab anything else um i'm gonna grab the pickaxe and we're we don't really need to make a house so that's normally starter one stuff but i think what we really could do is like just get set up with some stuff like you know some better armor and stuff so when we do get jumped jumping into that we can also um choose a class here there there's artisan lumberjack zilla miner In my other world i was a miner there's I think I'm going to probably go with Scout in this one, because Scout, I believe, is a fast type running. I don't know what type of achievements I get, but let's see. I'm pretty sure all the achievements are probably the same if I go with them. So crafting, specialization, 
there and we need uh, some blocks so I will go get some wood for this because there is some stuff like achievements that we can actually fulfill like right now not gonna lie we go right over here we can actually um, fulfill some of our quests some of our old quests I'm gonna go ahead and put that down here just so I can reach it and grab it whenever I need it. So there's a lot of stuff to do in this mod pack that, with exploration. I'm pretty hyped about that, not gonna lie. Because exploration is actually one of my favorite things to do, so. I hope this exploration goes pretty well. Hopefully we don't struggle with anything in this mod pack. There's some stuff I do need to learn about some of the mods. I know what A there is, but there is a mod I have never played with. Um... Which is, uh, what's this? Lapis Lotus. That's cute. I actually like this flower. It's very cute looking. So, what was I talking about? There's some stuff that I don't know. Like, the, one of the dimensions I don't know is the Between Lands, because I've never really played with the Between Lands before. Very shocking, but yeah, I've never played this. What is this? Is this like some sort of plant? There's like a lot of other plants in this I don't know about either, so... Yeah, don't mind me if I'm, like, looking at stuff like I've never seen it. It's because some of them I've never seen before. If I go like this, I could create that. And if I create this, I could actually create something like this. Which will create a crafting pad. Which means I don't have to place it just to craft things. Which will make things faster. And I just got two achievements right there. So we got this achievement. And we got this achievement, and because we have this pickaxe already, we have completed this achievement. So as you guys can see, achievements are actually pretty quick in this. We can also make a chest to complete a, another achievement. So all I have to do is just go to my crafting pad here and create a beautiful chest. And just like that, we got this one done. So it gives you all of these, like... These little coin things, as you guys realize, um, it gives you a lot of those. Um, you can actually buy items with that from the, uh, the quest shop. If you guys look over here, we got a little shop. You guys can buy anything from this that's in this mod pack, it seems. So that's pretty cool. You can buy food, you can buy loot boxes, which, darn, that's so epic. I've never seen a mod pack where you can get, like, stuff like that. I've never seen that, so I was thinking, this is definitely going to be an interesting one because it's really making you want to do the achievements. So, what I'm thinking is that we're just going to go through the achievements in a, in a type of order from, like, Overworld to, like, the last one, which is going to be, like, a, we're going to be going through the series for a while, if you think about it, because that's a lot of achievements here. Especially when we get all the way down here. Like, look at that. There's so many of them. Is that mini? Is that what I think? It oh my god. It's pets. They're pets. Are those like those pets? I think they're like inventory pets that you find in those trees. So I think we look through some trees sometimes we'll find them. So we can actually finish that one too pretty quickly. So if I go down here, we got a free mine. Really nice. Fast travel down ladders. I'm gonna go ahead and turn down my sound after I make it down here too. Alright, and we're all the way at level 11, which is diamond level already, so that's pretty crazy. I'm gonna go ahead and turn on our sound real quick here. Um, there we go. I think that should be good enough. What I'm gonna do with the, um, the chest I just created, the reason I wanted to create that is because I wanted to go like this to make the chest bigger, because I realized that that chest was pretty small. Down here, we actually got some really good stuff. We got a first diamond. We got some redstone. Like, they give you just some, like, pure starting stuff. So, what I want to do is I want to do a little bit of mining. Just to see what we can find. Oh, god, oh, god. Uh, we need to go, like, a level up from here. Because level 11 for me, I just feel that's too low of a level. Like, I feel like they put you way too low when you start this. Oh, wow. And right as we start, we're right near a mineshaft, too. I'm not going to go through the mineshaft just yet, because I don't want to deal with cave spires yet. also forgot to do such game roll, because if you guys know game roll, 
keep inventory because I have a weakness to um, losing stuff because I have bad memory. And if I die somewhere, I'm definitely not going to remember where I died. And I'm pretty sure you guys don't want me to go on a huge hunt. And I know there's some like difficult mobs in this because I realize that the um, the Ice and Fire mod, I think it's called, is in this with the dragons. So I'm afraid, like, well, if we run into one of those, <laughs> we're definitely gonna die if we run into one of those dragons. Um, I can't pick up that yet, so I have to mine around it. It's actually not bad to grab this, because I think... I don't know if Tinker's is part of this. Let's see, is Tinker's in this? I just got... Yeah, it is. It is in this. At least a Tinker... Uh, it's not the one that I know about. So Tinker's isn't in this, so Gravel isn't that important. I was like thinking maybe gravel will be important because you know Tinker's construct and stuff, but no, it's not in this. But awesome fact is Veinmeyer is in this, so I could just go like that. So I'm just gonna go ahead and mine a bunch of this stuff. So yeah, the first episode will be pretty much the mining here and there, and of course a lot of mining will be done in this one because we want to get like better like, geared so that we can actually start adventuring the overworld, which will be really nice. I should probably get some coal before I go like that. The best thing is about this that I'm doing here is I'm trying to just get stuff so that, um, I'm just trying to get this stuff so I can make iron gear so, so it's like better than the leather stuff I have right now so we can at least start adventuring through this uh, mine shaft right here. And just like that we got all our stuff. I don't know. Did I finish something? Yes, a furnace. And that unlocked all of these. I haven't seen these before yet, so that's going to be new to me. We can also make bandages, apparently. Really nice. Might have to see how to craft those. White sleeping bag. We can make a backpack. But yeah, there's a lot of stuff we need to get here. I, and I see that. I saw that there's colossal chests in there. And look at that. Fast furnaces. I love that. I did leave uh, some food back upstairs, but I got some food on me, so we should be fine. So we got acquiring hardware, and I'm going to go ahead and we're going to craft an iron pick, just in case I find some good stuff, and just so we can get the achievement too for it. Now what I'm going to do is we're just going to collect up some other stuff. We can also go like that. So we got to collect up to 24 iron for a full setup. The gear, I'm just gonna go like that just so it's not messy. You can put some more cobblestone up here just so I actually use it all. Um, we got 10, you can put that 6 in there. And I'm gonna go ahead and put this coal in here. Now we got that, we got 16 now. Really nice. And just like that, we should be good on that part. Yeah, we got a lot of stuff to do here. Um, I'm still not gonna go. Through. Maybe I can go through a little bit, see what we have. Oh, look, it's it's the gold iron redstone stuff. It's the gold redstone stuff. So there's actually mixed mixed ore. If you guys are wondering what that is, it's just like mixed ore, like this red gold clump, which just gives you like clumps and stuff. Um, what it is is just this. Oh wow. Um, block. Unlock block villager trades with red X or cures at zombie villager. Skeleton, what? Whoa, we got some good stuff here. Um, I don't even have to make one now for those. Firebomb. Scroll. Wow. What? Like, what's the chance of that? That's so cool. Oh my god, look at this stick. I'm grabbing that. I need that, you know? Knockback is so that I like, oh, top. Ooh, cool. So, yeah, we got a lot of stuff in this chest. That's pretty cool. I'll put these melon seeds right here. We can always come back here for them if I need them. For now, I don't really think I need them. I'll put this um, somewhere, too. I'm going to put that right there. Just so if I need to knock back a creeper or anything. Just so I can react. Um, let's actually put that right next to my sword. I feel like that's going to help me a lot. Other than having a bow, I can just knock back something away from me if I feel like it's too close. 
I feel like I'm in danger, that is. It's pretty nice, a knockback stick. I never thought we would find a, a knockback five stick. That That's something new right there. Look at this. A fisherman crate. Let's go ahead and break that. What do we get? Nothing? Interesting. Um, I don't know what that did. Not gonna lie. I think what those are is those are two, like, the class you have. Probably. I'm not fully sure. I should probably set a waypoint back at home. Or at least set a point where I can know where I am. We already have one of these. I don't know why I'm taking another one. Ooh, advanced. Oh, that's what we got. We got the fishing rod and stuff like that. It's pretty cool. Let's go back um, over here. I don't think it was over here. Uh, already lost. That's not good. That's the thing about um, mine chests. I'm gonna get lost. Well, it's definitely not this way. Oh god, I'm already lost. That's a bad thing. How am I already lost? This is how good I am, you know? I'm so pro at getting lost. Oh wait, here I am. I was about to say, there's no way I'm already that lost. Um, let's go ahead and let's go back upstairs. Let's grab that food I left upstairs too. Because you never know when I'll need that food. Just in case when I run out of bread. Plus, I want to set a waypoint in the house. I'm pretty sure waypoint is B if I'm not wrong. Unless there's some like keys messing with others. Which could be completely impossible. There's a lot of mods in this, so I wouldn't be surprised if there's some keybind problem, so. Oh, yeah, we could also sleep in our bed just so that when we die, we spawn back over here. Pretty nice. Let's go ahead. I hit, think it's B. Yes. Home. Just so if I go up somewhere else on the surface, if I get too far away from home, I can always know where this is, so. We aren't completely lost. And now we got our food. And look how much stuff we already have on us. Gosh. A lot of stuff. I'm going to put some stuff up here. Like that. We don't need this. We don't need fishing rod. This, this, this. Just want to put some stuff up here. That we don't need on us at the point. Look at that, we got the novice book and we got the advanced book, which is really nice. That's gonna help us a lot. I'm gonna keep all like the mine stuff on us, but that could definitely be put away. Um then we could put this here above that. Don't really know how much wood I'll need. I guess I could keep it to make sticks so I can make more torches. Yeah, that should be good on us for now. So, we already found mine shaft. We're already getting really cool loot, like the knockout stick and stuff like that. That's pretty fun. So yeah, there's actually a lot of stuff in this mod bag. There's also like little like pots you can find throughout the mines that will also give you like golden apples and stuff, which is really helpful. Especially for this mod pack, I feel like we really need those golden apples. Ooh, look at that. There's even like um quartz over here, so if I ever need quartz, I could go back down here and not have to have any issue with that. I also like how they have like the sounds mod in this. This is actually one of my favorite mods, is the um the sound mod, like where it changes like, all the sound effects. Oh look at that. We could go ahead and grab that. Dang, it even says saturation of hunger right there. I didn't notice that when you hit shift. We could probably go back. And I probably have enough iron now if I go back. Let's go ahead and, and put this stuff in our furnace and see what we get out of it. Because this first episode actually is going very well. I actually like how this is going. We got a lot of stuff going for us. We do have been mining, so we're definitely going to have a full set of iron right now. So <laughs> we're pretty good on that. We can keep exploring mines because there is a chance where we can find some like cool stuff still. And all that. Because like I said, exploration. Of course, oh, I did not mean to do that. But now we got steel. Okay. So that's how you make steel pretty much. I didn't even know steel was a part of this. My bad. I meant to like put it back in my inventory. But for some reason, I don't know what I did there. I just derped out. and just, I don't know how to explain it either. 
take this off. Let's put this old armor in here just so it's not taking space. And now let's put this on so we're more properly geared. There you go. So we are already on our first episode and we're already geared up in full iron gear. I think that's a good place to actually wrap up for this beautiful episode. We got a lot of mining to do in the next video. Um, when it comes to it for like other things like diamonds and stuff like that and of course looking for some more awesome loot because why not oh this gives oh that's cool I like this plant I've never seen such thing as such a cool mod oh and look at that perfect Get away from me, spider. Alright, what we're gonna do? Look at that. We can just come back over here and heal. That's so cool. Yeah. Yeah. The worst spiders ever. I'm not gonna lie. Case spiders are the worst. I'm so happy I did. Oh, are you serious? The hardest hitbox is the case spider, too. But not only that, there's also like, um. Oh. White sprout here. Got. Oh, I've never seen these before. Huh. Interesting. So, yeah, this mod definitely has a lot to. Um, there's a little frog down here. I didn't expect that. Oh, look, another fisherman crate where you get more fish or stuff. Oh, look at that, another fishing rod. So we can start fishing whenever we need to. <laughs> Maybe I'll make like a. AFK fishing type of machine for that, maybe? Uh, oh, wait, that doesn't work on this version. This is 1.12. Remember me on your little version, you're not quite there. But maybe I'll find a way to make like that happen in 1.12. I'm pretty sure you can have it happen in 1.12 with the auto fisher. Like the AFK fishing machine. Because I'd love to see, since this has like some advanced stuff to it, maybe you can catch better stuff from fishing. Does this do anything? No. Doesn't do anything. This is a red orb. Okay. So it doesn't do anything. I thought it had like an uh, effect like the other one did. That's why I stood at it. It's like, huh, maybe this also gives you a nice effect too. But yeah, this is actually a really nice mod pack so far from what I'm seeing from it. And I'm actually quite enjoying it, honestly, myself. I feel like once we get into the huge adventure aspect too, look at that, there's obsidian ore in this, which is very fascinating. So yeah, I think that's where I'm going to wrap up for this episode. We have done a lot, I feel like we got pretty far for our first episode, and this is like a first look. If you guys want this to be a series, be sure to let me know, smash that like button, let me know if you like it, and down in the comments maybe say this is a great mod pack. If you guys want me to continue it, or if you guys want me to do a different mod pack for a test. I'm just trying to find like, a nice modded series that I can enjoy myself. And we could just enjoy until 1.16 comes out. So, so I can bring back Minecraft a little bit. Because before Minecraft wasn't here at all. And now it's back with this. And I hope that you guys can understand that. I'm getting back in MC. And I wanted to give it into modded because I want to wait for 1.16 survival. So that I could have that as a survival series. And you guys could watch. Which would be pretty epic. So that's going to wrap up with this episode. If you guys are new to my channel. And this is the first video you see. You're not sure whether you like the content or not. Be sure to check out some other videos, see if I bring out what, what some stock that you like. If, if it's not what you like, you can go on to pass. But if you do love the content and you think you'll enjoy it and you want to stick around, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you can keep up to my latest content and live streams because I love to do interactive streams here and there. Um, maybe next weekend I'll be doing a the streams. I'm sorry I didn't stream at all this weekend like I thought I would. But, um... The last weekend like I thought I would, but hopefully this time I can make it up to you guys with some more streams on Saturdays and Sundays. Those should be the days I'm streaming, but yeah, um, I think I should be feeling a lot better for that now, and yeah, maybe you will do another live stream. Sorry for the lack of those, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video live stream, and that is one heck of a loud plane. See you guys next time. <laughs> 
Thank you stars so much for watching this video if you guys have enjoyed and you guys want to see more content if you guys are new to the series be sure to check out the first episode of the series if you guys have not it's really worth it and also if you guys want another sub content if you missed the last video I've uploaded you guys could also check that out also don't forget to check out my discord join it you know just be able to talk to the others where I do my announcements and stuff like that and also don't forget to check out my planet minecraft account so that you guys can go check out the latest maps i make or latest skins i put up so that's where i'm gonna leave you guys you guys have a great day see everyone